A great deal of thanks goes to discount brokers who made it easier and cheaper for all of us to invest in the stock market. But they aren't all created <laughs> equally. To present the Luffy for best discount broker, Dayana Yoakum. All right. The nominees for beginning investors. Charles Schwab. This is like the play it safe first date film. Schwab has been around forever. They've got tons of educational content. They've got affordable commissions, great customer service, both online and you can get in-person hugs at various branches if you live near one. Seriously? You can just walk in and ask for a hug? Well, I haven't actually tried it, but I'm assuming... No, but they advertise this? They're like, come on in for a hug. Oh, yeah. That's what they want you to do. Everyone go out and try it. Let us know how it works out. Take no, a, take Allison. a picture, take a video. They and don't advertise that. Take a video and send it to us, and we'll play it on the podcast. <laughs> I have heard of. Slash, yeah. I have probably heard Hashtag. of worse, worse things that companies have done to try to like make make you feel all warm and fuzzy. Charles Schwab doesn't need to. Charles Schwab does not want Chuck, your hugs. Chuck, back away from Chuck. Okay, doesn't need your hugs. It's Mr. Schwab to you. Yeah. But you might want to wander in there. They've got. Uh, 3,000 commission-free ETFs and no transaction fee mutual funds, and that's more than anyone else in the industry. So this makes Schwab a great choice for beginning investors. Our second nominee for the budget investors, Robinhood. And this is an investment app, actually. Um, this is like the low-budget indie film that's making a splash. Um, this this app has totally free trading of more than 5,000 equities and ETFs. And this is no frill stuff. You pay no commissions, but also you can't invest in mutual funds. There are no, there's no research or fancy tra- trading, you know, do hookies and bells and whistles. And it only supports taxable accounts. So you can't open a Roth IRA with Robinhood. But for free trades, can't beat it. Cheap. Free is cheap. 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 Stealing from the rich. Our next nominee is for Active Traders, and it's Options House. It's like the guys in the big short who have multiple screens and lots of flashing charts and stuff. Um, Options House has robust mobile and online trading platform for stocks, bonds, ETFs, funds, options, of course, and futures. Options House merged with Trade Monster in late 2014, and Trade Monster is known for its really um, fast execution and sophisticated trading tools. So that upped the game for Options House. There are no inactivity fees, and so that's great when you see that day trading isn't exactly your path to future wealth. <laughs> Spoiler. <laughs> <laughs> and the winner is it's Options House. Options House, really? really? Yeah. yeah. For trading? Interesting. No, this here it is interesting. This. Broker appeals to all audiences. It's like an action movie with plot and a heartfelt performance by Meryl Streep. Uh, (laughs) And it's also one of NerdWallet's best overall discount brokers for 2016. It's got five out of five stars. The other, um, another one that got five out of five is TD Ameritrade. What makes Options House appealing for a wide swath of investors is is that it has a zero dollar minimum to open and maintain an account, so you can get started right away. And trades are cheap; they're four ninety five. That is cheap. 